Hello Benny old chap. Hello Nestor old boy. How are you doing today? Well I'm doing just dandy Nestor. What can I do for you? I have a wee problem Benny. I've got three marbles here. But I need to know how much glass I need to make 24 marbles. I tried to use a ruler to measure the marbles. But that didn't help me. Can you help me here? I see what you mean Nestor. Why don't we both work on it together? As they say, two heads are better than one. Nestor and Benny knew about Archimedes and the work he did, so they had a very good idea of what they should do. Nevertheless, they still had to select and do some planning and do some carrying out and do some reporting. And this is what they did. Happy birthday to the number one Bernard fan. Hope you have a great time with your friends and family on your 13th birthday. I'm now going to drop the marbles into the measuring cylinder. I'm going to put an apple in the water into the measuring jug. The measuring jug is filled to the brim, so anything that goes into the measuring jug will make the water overflow. I'm going to put an apple in and let's see what happens. The apple floats as some water overflowed. Can you find a connection between bodies that float and the water that overflows. What to do is, weigh the body that floats, float it in the water, then weigh the water that overflows, and see if you can find a connection. You can do it with your friends, you can do it with your family. It's a worthwhile activity and you'll learn a lot from it. Thank you very much for watching The Young Scottish Physicist. If there's any questions on anything I've said, leave them on a post, or speak to them in school, and until next time, Thank you very much.